What's happening, guys? It's Tuesday, June the 21st. Classic Chris here with another episode of Wrestling Talk. And we got some big news. You know what? Money in the Bank, it's a thing of the past. I enjoyed the pay-per-view. I liked how they did the finish. You know, it was something different. I It, it surprised me. So, you know what? I'm tipping my cap to WWE on that. You know what? I'm giving them, a, giving them some props on that one because, for once, it wasn't predictable. You have Seth Rollins becoming the WWE World Heavyweight Champion again. Then Dean Ambrose immediately cashing in the Money in the Bank and walking out as the new champion. On the same night, all three members of the Shield were WWE Champion. And that's huge because the Shield are WWE homegrown. They are their equivalent to the Four Horsemen. They're equivalent to the NWO. This is something that the WWE originated. And everybody knew once the Shield was together that when they broke up, that they'd be a huge part of the main event scene. But... That's not what I'm talking about today. Today, what I am talking about is Roman Reigns has been suspended by the WWE for 30 days for violating the company's talent wellness policy. Roman Reigns tweeted out the following. I apologize to my family, friends, and fans for my mistake in violating WWE's wellness policy. No excuses. I own it. That is huge news for everyone that does not like Roman Reigns. That means you get 30 days without Roman Reigns. And that also gives WWE some time to repackage him because, like I've said before in many, many, many videos, Roman Reigns is not 100% over. And they need to repackage this guy somehow. And obviously they didn't want to go with the heel route, even though he was getting booed. I would have liked to have seen him go heel like The Rock did. You know, it, it could have done a lot for his character because think about it. Right now, Roman Reigns has faced every single heel the WWE has given him and defeated them, except for Seth Rollins. If he was a heel, that would allow him to feud with Dean Ambrose, John Cena, uh, the list can go on, Dolph Ziggler, I don't know why I mentioned Dolph Ziggler, because the WWE doesn't take him serious, so why should the fans? Like, you know what I mean? But that's the thing. But Roman Reigns being suspended, I want to know, guys. Are you happy to see him gone? Do you wish he was suspended even longer? Or are you a Roman Reigns fan? Leave a comment with your thoughts, like the video, subscribe, keep watching Wrestling Talk with Classic Chris, and don't forget to check out the YouTube channel for Classic Chris, your home for everything wrestling talk, plus matches I've called from Crossfire and Conflict Wrestling.